Hi, Tomasz Pawłowski here. On behalf of Qt Quality Assurance Team, I'm glad to present the latest release of Squish GUI Tester version 7.2, which brings a suite of powerful new features aimed at enhancing your automated GUI testing experience. As professionals in the field, we understand the significance of robust testing tools and we are excited to share the improvements this update brings to multiple areas of testing. A standout feature in this release is our commitment to supporting Qt applications on the WebAssembly platform. Introducing the new Squish for Qt for WebAssembly package, you now have the capability to instrument Qt application built with Qt for WebAssembly and seamlessly run them in web browsers for testing with Squish. Detailed information on this feature are available in a dedicated video where I demonstrate how to make Qt for WebAssembly application testable with Squish, how to create a few example automated GUI tests and ultimately demonstrate that Squish which is a true cross-platform tool by running created tests on different platforms. But now we'll move on with the release overview. Our dedication to refining screenshot verification points has led us to significant improvements. Incorporating images from external resources is now a streamlined process with the introduction of the new function test VP with image. Together with the existing function test VP with object, we are providing increased flexibility when working with screenshot verifications. You can now take advantage of features such as image comparison with thresholds, positive and negative masks, and even specify a time for verification retries after failures. Moreover, we have refined the way failed attempts are presented in test results, offering a clearer analysis for further actions. As professionals who understand the value of accurate and detailed reporting, we have made enhancements to the JUnit report, a popular choice for integrating Squish with CI, CD or test management tools. The updated report now includes valuable information about skipped tests, providing the context and reasons for skipping test cases, sections or BDD steps. Navigating the object map editor has never been more efficient and intuitive. A new button allows you to instantly view the selected object in the application object view with Squish IDE, streamlining the process of inspecting UI objects, properties, and their relationships. We are pleased to announce that we now offer custom extensions of the Qt Wayland and Weston compositors, catering to Squish users testing applications run with the Wayland platform architecture. These extensions grant you access to desktop screenshots, enable emulation of native clicks and keyboard input and more. Comprehensive instructions on how to install and effectively use these extensions are now available in the improved Squish documentation. Tags play a crucial role in organizing test cases, and we have made important improvements in this regard. You can assign tags to BDD scenarios inside the feature file, aligning with the Gherkin syntax for consistent. With the UX improvement in the Squish IDE, you cannot assign a tag to BDD test case, as it will be ignored anyway. Furthermore, filtering test cases by tag in Squish IDE has been optimized to seamlessly handle hybrid test suits containing both BDD and scripted test cases. In response to user feedback, we are pleased to announce that Squish can now be built with Python 3.11. While the default version shipped with Squish remains Python 3.10, we are here to support you in case you require Python 3.11 for your testing needs. Beyond the major highlights, this release contains various smaller improvements and fixes for testing Qt, Java, Web, native Windows and iOS applications. Our continuous commitment to enhancing the Squish experience is reflected in this requirement. We encourage you to refer to comprehensive Squish 7.2 release notes, we value your feedback and we are dedicated to providing you with a seamless testing experience. We understand the importance of trying out new tools before committing and we are excited to let you know that a free trial of Squish GUI Tester is available for you to explore. This trial version allows you to experience the full range of features and capabilities that Squish offers. You can make an informed decision about its suitability for your testing requirements. To get started with the free trial, simply visit our website and follow the easy step to access this powerful testing tool. We are confident that once you have a chance to see Squish in action, you will be enthusiastic about its potentials as we are. Thank you once again for being a part of the Squish community. If you have any questions or require assistance during your trial, our dedicated support team is always here to help you.